thinking more about it, I think uh, I think it's the intent, you know. The intent we'll of the chef. About it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think that's really important to remember in this day and age, you know. Yeah, but most chefs aren't thinking about that. I feel like if you just I mean, had like, independence. If they prepare two like lasagnas, though, even if you stack them, like they, you know what I mean? Yeah. So here we are. We're gonna have Shulk versus Tuna. Uh, I don't know much about this matchup. I just know that Shulk has good buttons and Toon Link has good buttons, but that's not really unique to characters in Ultimate because almost everyone has good buttons, except for maybe Byleth, who has kind of bad buttons. Either way, by buttons, it I mean. Looks normals. like Carl's is doing a lot. Yeah, I Obviously, don't... he's starting with Speech uh, Shulk, and that just gets you so much damage. Yeah, so I would assume that uh, Shulk just has a big sword, so you know. In uh, theory, the big short sword should beat the little sword, you know? Yeah, but Kama has a lot of things to throw out. Yeah, but like, his project uh, Toon Link's projectiles aren't as good as, like, say, Young Link's. Young Link's or something? Okay. Yeah. Uh, I know Kama hates when people uh, start saying, do I have a gameplay? I will. All right. Oh. Alright, okay. right, back to the match. Uh, I did. I, I wasn't looking at the stream for the, like a little bit, but I did see uh, Carl's shield art out of up B out of shield, which is a big thing because Toon Link's up B out of shield is actually pretty good. It's pretty good for ledge trapping and it kills at late percents. Uh, so, let's see. Sorry, how did you say works. Young Link's up B out of shield? Toon Link's up shield. That, that's what I meant to. I might have said Young Link out of... I know... Ka I said this briefly before. Kama does not really like when people compare Toon Link to Young Link. But, you know. That's got to be the most comparable character, though, right? Yeah, it, With, like, projectiles and... I, I guess, like... Does I mean, he not Toon get Link's... as much off of his projectiles? Ooh, nice, nice F smash. That's not... It's not uh, uh, that bad of a game. What... Um, does he not get as many like combos off of his like arrow or like side B's and I mean all the links have like uh, Boomerang combos and the thing about okay, so Toon Link has like the bomb combos I'm not sure if they're as prominent in this game, but they were in Smash 4 uh, And I assume they're like sort of similar maybe just not as good mm -hmm. and young link definitely has like his bombs are a little like, less useful But the fire arrows are just really good. That's not a headset. Yeah, uh, a second. Here. All right, hold up Once again, there are two tours on the mic, which makes me happy. So we got, we got two waters on. Oh, two tours. The, the yeah, lasagnas. Lasagna. All right. I mean, y'all come up with some of the weirdest debates. I don't know. I, I, I didn't come up with it. I just brought it up. I, I don't I don't I don't know who y'all is. Just whoever they are, they need to stop. <laughs> that, that's fair. That's fair. I think this debate is like it's pretty forward thinking. You know, it's like. It's, it's it, very forward thinking that like in the next few years after climate catastrophe has rendered 95% of the planet inhospitable We'll need to know how many lasagnas are in this lasagna. Yeah Yeah, so how I mean is, how's the game for going? like food? Before, okay, we'll get to this after the set Oh, that, that was almost a shield break, but as you can see Carlos has a pretty steady lead He has a full stock lead and uh, I I, I, walked, I walked in, they were both in the same stock. Comment was just at 53%, so like... Yeah, we're not doing a great job at looking at the game. Carl <laughs> certainly knows how to... Oh, no. Oh, man. Certainly knows how to get, in a, how to get a lead going. Yeah. These uh these Toon Link buffs, sadly, just oh, did no. not come through for our boy. So, Comet is going to... Uh, I mean, Carl's is going to take that first game. Did he talk? No, that was, uh, that was Smash Monado activating. Oh, okay. Although, although, I am a thousand percent convinced Carl's intended for you to interpret it as a taunt. He's like that. All right, yeah, He likes yeah. to throw out down smashes after the game is over. That's true, he does. So, Oh, we got Violet. Violet. Oh, no. Uh, so, I'm just going to say right now that if this matchup was played against, like, two evenly experienced players, Byleth would lose. Byleth would hard lose. I think Comet got this, though. I think, he, I think if he keeps his head in the game, he certainly has a chance. But I also think that Comet is one of those players that starts to fall behind and kind of loses confidence in themselves. Yeah, I can see that. Got a, good, got a nice start going on here. Like, not only got a good combo, but kept him in the corner. Sadly, couldn't keep it. Yeah. So, the thing about Carl's secondaries is, is that they're nowhere near as good as his Shulk. I'm sorry, Carl, if you're watching this, but it's just the truth. I think he knows. 
That's and, fair. And if Carl decides to watch it later, I'm going to go one step further, and I'm going to say that he plays most of his secondaries like he plays Shulk. Yeah, I can see Just that. A lot, lot of jumping, a lot of landing aerials. But with Violet, it's more understandable because her grounded moves are mostly trash. Yeah. I take that back. They're good. They're, her, her grounded moves Well, good. all just, of her moves in retrospect are trash. Just because of who they're attached to. Yeah. Wait, what? I That's, like Violet. But I don't like how laggy all of her moves are. I hate how laggy her moves are. I hate how light she is. The what? That's true. Oh, I am well aware that male Byleth exists, and even though I play male Byleth, I refuse to acknowledge it. I I I, I play both. I play uh, the claw. Ooh, oh no! Actually, that was the first time I've ever seen down air spike. Oh, that's a taunt. He earned that. He yeah. earned that taunt. Yeah, that's fair. Ori Oreo's got me with that before. He like took away all my options and just went for it. All right, up yet a shield. I, I I prefer female Byleth's character design. I just hate her costume. Yeah, Cannot I, stand her costume. That. Those, like, leggings. The leggings, the, 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 the Genji knee pad, the weird belly button window. Okay, to be fair, like, Krom has a pretty whack outfit. Yeah, and I hate Krom's outfit, too. Just, Violet's was the one that finally went a step too far for me. But, <laughs> yeah. like, stockings. Yeah. Lacy stockings. Th that, like, if they were tattoos, that, that'd that be, like, that'd at be least... Sick. Yeah, that, that would be sick. It would, it would make her look a lot like uh, the protagonist from Bloodstained. But right, but instead they went to, with stockings. But like the really the thing that gets me is like the belly button window is clearly meant to be like it's sexy. It's not sexy. <laughs> it just looks weird. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's like if you want to bear your midriff, like wear wear a tank top or something. <laughs> like the the belly window is just absurd. <laughs> uh, I do not know if side B two frames while you're grounded. I know that aerial uh, it'll like um, go slightly below side you. B? Yes, I do. Uh, I don't feel like it does. The hitboxes are online, so we can check like after this. Yeah, but I'm not going to. <laughs> I'm surprised that Up Smash didn't kill, just considering how light Byleth is. Yeah. Okay. That was a good, a good cross oh. of up air. Catches him jumping with side B. Yeah. Now side B is an excellent aerial option because it hits below and above you. It's also a good like if you if you're hard calling out a jump, but like I don't know who's calling out a jump that hard. I just throw it out sometimes. I usually call. I don't use it to call out jumps. More so, that I use it to call he, like people on a platform. He wanted that shield to break. He was holding it. He uh, he he, he think, wanted up yet a shield. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say like it looked like he wanted something and he just kept tilting his shield, which is annoying. Yeah. Comet, do you play on low sensitivity? Because if you play on high sensitivity, that's definitely easier. I think that only affects smash attacks. No, it is. It affects all smash inputs. So like up oh, yet a shield. So, like. like is it explicitly just smash inputs, like yeah. things that require, like kind of like you can smash a boomerang or you can tilt a boomerang. Yeah. Ah, oh, okay. That makes sense. Like, uh, Palutena's side B. Certainly didn't do a very good job of explaining that in this game. Uh, yeah. That forward smash almost hit. He was calling out a jump there and he could have had it. All right. Ooh. If you can space, if you can like zone yourself, then uh, that bow is not bad. I just I do feel like Comet is kind of giving it too much respect. Like he's letting he's trying to play around Byleth's zoning yeah. options when he's the zoner. Yeah. Byleth should be playing around his options. He needs to set his zone up. Even after the first arrow, uh, Byleth like uh, what's it called? Failed. Oh! oh no, that's gonna catch the neutral getup. Uh, Byleth's uh, arrow is like pretty pretty. Uh, what do you call it? Laggy. All of her, yeah, all of her stuff are laggy. So what were you saying about lasagna? I don't explicitly remember what I was saying about lasagna. 